My name is Peter Isingoma. I'm the District Commissioner for Scouts Masindi. This is, this is a short film that's going to introduce to you the work that has been done by Scouts in Masindi and Scouts from Hampshire. This project has been working together to provide clean well for villages in Masindi District. This started in the year 2000 when the Scouts from Hampshire first visited Masindi. They had three projects planting of trees, construction of the education hall, and building one well. Hello, Cladu Rich School. This is the plank which we shall put on the well after the construction. From the money you raised to facilitate this well, Nyamalingo. In appreciation to the community, the love and friendship we have as a link in scouting, Masindi District, Ambusinge Jonathan, Secretary for Scouts. Um, this is the well which we are going now to construct we, using the money solicited from your school. Thank you very much. Basi kau tuko, baba vuntu be dini, mweva di kuija, ukui mche kichwa kaki yangu. Amabara gani ni yajoni kiza chia man LC1 kiguni. Okay. Kiza chia person LC1 kiguni. He was appreciating the scouts from UK, Pembrokeshire and Hampshire scouts, then Masindi scouts, for the work you are going to do for the construction of their well. Them as local people and their local village, they are very happy for this work which will be done. And to them, they are now relieved of uh, drinking dirty water. So they are now uh, anticipating to have safe water. Thank you for coming. Jonathan, can you ask the chairman here how many villages that this well serves and who, how it benefits them? Okay, Ugamba. Chia person not to go and be a zivali no pantu vainga avanua. A zivali no anuamu vantu be cum be vich. Two hundred people benefit from this well. And how many villages? How many villages? Every hour of the bibidi, a kitu head a kiaki jumbura, ne kianga kinu, a kiaki gunia. Two villages, kijumbura and kigunia. And what would they benefit by having clean water? Uh, kunihira is very no of the Ayombequa. Been to key a Raba Murekiri, Kuba by Nimbona Bona, Mine, busy with your mice in Akinaga, busy booking Mukunihira, Kuba Muetangi. Your Kubanza to Jacoba to a tangi, eh? And war diseases, a Kiakabiri, Ki Jacoba Kitukoni, Avakara Vai to Kuba. The housewives will be relieved of using dirty water, now they will be using safe water. The housewives will be Exaru is the Hello? Mm. Hello? this black flies. Black flies. Mm. Okay, now like he, the children when they come here, they will be relieved of fetching that water and at times there are black flies which cause them diseases. How far, how far the villagers have to walk to get their water? What's the furthest? Avant wabakusinga yu kuija kutaha maizi bakulibata buraira ki. Maire mo. One kilometer. Mm. My name. 
and that's from little ones to older people. Yeah, from the little ones to the elder ones. Yeah. For each per family, how many containers does it do they have to have per day of water? How many times do they have to come to the The jerrycans per family will vary how big the family is. But others use five, others use ten, depending on the size of the family. How, how old is when do they start carrying water? How little are they? Abana baija kutabara maizi, but tanika kutabara miyake yugaha. Abana kutanika miyaka ikumi, kumi neta anu, ugeena mpaka. So children coming from 6 years to 10 to 15, that's the range. But usually here, a child of 6 carries a 3 liter jerry can. And that's how it starts. And the last question, for this. <coughs> How has the clean water helped you and your family, and what benefits has the water made? Um, the cocos of the river. Amazing, 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 amarungi. The kony gata amakagan. Amazing, amarungi gano. This clean water. Wawakuluka watu mbekele izuba. When this water was constructed, chikongeraho omuti ndogo buyonjo. It it increased, it improved on the sanitation in our families. Abantu bakiyarwara. Very few people now fall sick on the waterborne diseases. Budi tuwakagantu warwara muna bana bana musu yajionka tuwakiyarwara. We used to have children falling sick more frequently, but now the degree of sickness has lessened. Muzani yonyo yonka tukundu ndi buyonjo. Even him now he looks a bit strong and clean. Benefits. The sanitation in our village has risen. They know that when you drink water, that's life. So they are drinking clean water. For him, he believes even if you have little food, but if you drink clean, good water, you can still live. Even if you are in hospital, they will tell you, first of all, put on a water drip for life. If you have not, if they have not bathed, they will get some diseases associated with not bathing, but this water gives them to bathe. They even use the water for cleaning to make them clean. So with them as a village, they have come to know that the use of clean water benefits them a lot.